Hi YouTube, this is Minnie. Welcome to Beauty and Worship. I am here to do a makeup look today. It's a purple look that I'm going for. So here you see me applying my MAC Prep and Prime to my face just to kind of prepare my face. And next, I am applying the MAC Concealer in NW45. As I look at this now, I can see that I didn't really blend it in as well as I should have, but it still worked when I applied the powder, the loose powder, just to kind of set it. The thing is, whenever I'm doing these videos before I get ready to go to work, I'm always kind of in a rush. And so here I'm applying the loose finishing powder. This is by Black Opal and Deep. I don't know why I make those faces. I guess, I don't know if other people make those faces or not. I never even paid attention to it, but <laughs> I make all these crazy faces when I'm doing make my makeup anyway. So here I'm just applying my uh, MAC Studio Tech. This is an NW45 as well. So here I'm just applying the powder around my eyes again. And I'm applying that same powder on my face just to kind of set the makeup, set the foundation. And here I'm applying the Sketch. This is the Sketch Eyeshadow from MAC. I usually use this as my transitional color for most of my makeup looks. I'm looking at a plane go by. I live in an area where planes fly by my house all the time, so. You'll see me looking out my window a lot <laughs> when I'm making my videos. So there we go. We're still just applying it. Just doing those little windshield wiper movements. Does it look okay? <laughs> And so here I'm applying the eyeshadow from Urban Decay Alchemy. So here I'm just applying the Alchemy towards the outer corner of my eyelid. And you guys, I'm gonna kinda have my head down a little low in some parts, I'm sorry. Like now, I'm going to do better with this. I just have to get a better mirror. And it's like I always remember while I'm doing it and then I'll look up and be like, oh, sorry. <laughs> and now I'm about to apply Sonic. So I'm going to apply that towards the middle and inner corners of my eyes just to kind of give it more of a, like a gradient look. And now I'm just going to blend it out 
just blend those two together right in between so the colors just kind of blend seamlessly. So I'm just blending that out again. And again, I'm sorry, I'm down a little low. Y'all see me with my do-rag on my head. Well, it's not a do-rag, it's just my scarf from when I did that clay mask. Um, this was me getting ready to go to work on that day that I did the clay mask. So here I'm just applying the bamboo to the area right below my eyebrows. And I'm just trying to brush some of that fallout off my face. So here, <laughs> I'm sorry guys, okay. <laughs> so here I'm just applying the eyeliner I didn't do too bad this time, but I was trying to hurry up. And that's just a regular e.l.f. black mascara. So here I'm just applying the, the mascara. As I said in one of my other videos, I always do several coats just so my eyelashes will look, they'll stand out more since I don't put on lashes. For years, I didn't put mascara on on the bottom of my eyes because sometimes it would give me raccoon eyes, but now I do it more. I don't know what was wrong back then when I used to do it and it um, gave me raccoon eyes. Maybe I just didn't let it dry enough. I don't know. Here I am with my eyebrow pencil. I still haven't sharpened it. I'm, <laughs> I'm going to have to soon because sometimes when I'm using it, I hit some of those sharp edges, the wood edges. I know I need to go ahead and do it. That's just me being lazy. I don't ever think to do it until I'm actually applying it and I'm just trying to hurry up. And there I am just applying the bamboo again. So here I am about to apply the Baked Powder Blush, Rose Dioro from Milani. I think I said Mazzani the last time, but it's Milani. And now I'm applying the lip liner. It's called Vino. I got that from MAC too. I don't remember the name of it. That's it. Okay guys, so I'm back. I have my makeup on, my clothes on for the day, and 
I didn't put anything else in my hair besides that grapeseed oil that you saw me apply to my hair. So we'll just see how this comes out today. Um, it's not dripping or anything like that. So yeah, thanks for watching and have a wonderful, wonderful day. God bless you and thank you for watching this video.